Hello friends, Misha Crossing here. Welcome to another day on Kiyoshi Farm here in Stardew Valley. Today we're going to start off with a little bit of house decorating before moving on to building a new thing. A new thing on the farm uh, is going to be built, but first I wanted to add a few little additions to my bedroom here. Since we just recently got the house upgrade, uh, I did some decorating over here in the living room and kitchen, but not really much in the bedroom. So I'm trying to figure out, trying to figure out what I want to do here. And I thought I was going to play a day off episode, off camera, just to collect some resources and, you know, get some wood and some stone for a new thing to build on the farm. But, uh, it turns out I don't, I don't need to. We're gonna, we're gonna be okay. I just need to get a few, do a little bit of foraging, do a little bit of resource collecting before going to the carpenter, but not too much. Okay, sorry, I'm really trying to figure out exactly what we want. Yeah, I think I want... Do I want an end table? Let me try the dresser. I don't want to get too much out. Like, I don't want to overdo it. Definitely don't want to overdo it. But I also don't want to miss anything. I feel like every time I go through this item spawner and go through the furniture, I end up missing something. And I have established that I am completely cheating and using mods to decorate my house. It's one of the few things I'm going all out on for. Oh, the skeleton would be cute for uh, for mods. Oh, I did want a chair. Yeah, the red armchair would be good. Um, I want just like a small corner table. Yeah, maybe just... Oh yeah, the mahogany, mahogany end table. That will do it nicely. I think I want one more plant as well. <laughs> but which one? Such a debate. Okay, this one looks nice. So maybe let's put armchair down here. This dresser is another mod. It's the get dressed mod and I don't think I actually need to have the dresser in my house. Okay, I cannot move the bed. But I like it there. So we will keep it. Nice, okay, I'm really glad that you can rotate this. And, oh, I need to move everything else up here. Oh, and we'll have to go see our new deer. We've got two new deer in our, in our barn. And two of our deer we can get milk from already, which is awesome. Why can you not place anything right here? You can place it right here, but not right here. I don't like it. It's very restricting and I don't appreciate it, but we'll get past it. Um, I think maybe this right here, this right here, that right there. <laughs> can this, that can't be moved, okay. Oh, can that, can the plant not go? No, that plant can't go on that table. Okay, that's fine. If I could put this there. Hmm. Should just get a bunch more plants. I just want so many plants. I don't know if this bear statue is really gonna work. Maybe it'll it would work better in here. I feel like he's just a little too big for what I'm trying to do, but I don't know. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, not really digging him. He's cute, but not not really picking up what he's putting down, you know? All right, so that'll stay right there for right now. And... Mm, yeah, all the mods that I use in this Let's Play series are linked in the description box below. Oh, there's a bonsai tree. Um... Yeah, they're linked in the description box below, just so you know. If you're ever wondering uh, how 
something looks different than it normally does or there's a mechanic that works differently than it normally does, uh, that's probably because I am using a mod for it. Uh, so just check the description box to find, find those. <laughs> Ooh, that's cute. That's cute. I think maybe one more plant. Maybe two more plants. I like this one too. Can this one be... Nope. I feel like there's one that can be placed on a table. Can the bonsai tree? Nope. Oh, okay, yeah, it can. It can be placed on the little end table there. But it won't work on on the dresser. That sucks, but oh well. Maybe I'll just do few plants right here. Hmm. Put a little bear right there. Oh, that could be cute. Okay, okay. Oh wait, I already have a red armchair right there. Oh man, now I'm getting, now I'm getting real picky. Okay, I'm just gonna change this chair out and then we're going outside. Sorry, I've taken up a lot of time already just redecorating. Oh, I don't want the brown one. Maybe the blue one or the yellow one. Let's try both of those. Thinking I will like the blue one more. Okay, man. Back in there you go. There you go. Okay, that is looking a little better. I just don't want it to be all, you know, one color. I want it to be a teensy bit colorful. Okay, that looks good enough for now. I will make some more adjustments. I'll find something to put on this table here. We'll, we'll, we'll make some changes as, as we go, but I'm pretty happy with the way my house is looking so far. On and out here, the leaves are falling. The grass is green. The tank is clean. Okay, I have to be like just close enough to it. There we go for the water to be able to hit the hit the ball. We got Zuko, hello, and Margo. Margo. Meow, yes. And Azula. Such happy babies. Oh, and I can delete all these guys now. I will get a couple of eggs to start. Start some mayo here. I don't even remember what our preserves jar is working on right now. Honestly, I think I put something new or different in there. Oh, here's our little chick chick chickens laying eggs for mama in here. No, don't eat the egg. Alright, I think I hugged. I always do that. I always accidentally say I'm gonna eat the egg. Alright, you guys have fun in there or come out here. It's a beautiful day. Come on outside. Don't stay. Don't stay cooped up. Ha ha. Ha ha. Ha ha. Get it? All right, down here. Oh, we got some crops to collect here. Um, what are these? Oh, yeah, they're grapes. Got a bunch of grapes to collect. I think... Oh, no, I do see some cranberries down there that we need to harvest. I do believe that's it. All that we can harvest right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and sell a bunch of this. I always get just so many eggs. I don't need to keep all these eggs on me. And cranberries and grapes. Yeah, I'm just gonna sell all these because I'm gonna be harvesting more of them and I've already harvested several of them. So we're good, we're Gucci. Oh, and we got some... What is it? Uh, I did not mean to collect the tapper, <laughs> but we got some pine tar and I have another tapper somewhere. Is it down here? Yeah, it is down here. I kind of want to chop this tree down so that I can see it a little bit better. There we go. Maybe clear some of this some of this grass away. 
I should probably put a little path around it like I have with this tree just to indicate that this is the one. This is the one with the tapper on it. I'll do that another day. I wanna go see my lovely little deer in their barn here. Got a couple babies, a couple adults. Oh, hi, let's see. This is Dana. Dana's fun. We got so many white deer and Kay, the baby. And then I can't remember what color. Okay. Izzy is the adult white one, and B is the brown adult one. They're all so cute. And I can use my pail to milk the adult ones. Okay. <laughs> I'm trying to click. There we go. There we go. Got some milk. There we go. I was just click clicking the wrong button. That was my bad. And we've got two, two jugs of deer milk. Again, these are cows, so they are mooing. Um, but there's just a mod that retextures them and makes them look like deer. I wish there was uh, a sound effect to replace the mooing or something. Whoops. Because it does sound just a little strange when looking at the deer, but it is, it is all right. Okay, we are going to sell a couple things and we are going to be building a well today. That is the new, new building we are going to be constructing, but I need to get some stone first. I don't think, nope, okay. Can't do that. I hear you mooing, deer, you weirdos. I just need to get a little bit more stone. I just need 75 stone. And I already have, yeah, I already had 59, so now we got 61. So we don't need too much more. And then we will go see, nope, that's not the thing. Then we will go visit the carpenter and uh, order our new, order our new well. Did I say well or stable a minute ago? What did I say? We're building a well. I don't know. I don't know what I said. I don't know if I misinformed you or not. That was that was too long ago already. No idea what I said. <laughs> but yeah, the well it just costs a thousand gold and uh, takes seventy five stone, and we haven't had one yet, and we need one. Well. Because of my mods, I don't really need one because all of my crops get automatically watered anyways. But I think it's going to look nice. There we go. Going to be a nice addition to Kiyoshi Farm. Alright, we got our 75 stone. We are ready to go. Let me put all of this stuff back in here. Oh, we got some mixed seeds. I'll go plant those hole in here. I should probably, yeah, I'm gonna smelt. Let's, let's do a little smelting. Um, I can't, I can never remember how much coal I need. I think I need five ore to every one coal for a bar. I'm pretty sure. Well, oh no, it's already 5.40 p.m. Poop. <laughs> We are not going to be able to get uh, get our well started today, but I think I might just have an early night tonight. And uh, oh, a pickled eggplant is what I had in there. That's interesting. I think I might just have an early night tonight and go ahead and play through tomorrow too, so I can get the get the well started. I took too much time, too much time uh, decorating the interior of my house and wandering around the farm. But that's okay. A okay. No harm done. We're just gonna play through a second day in this video. I've done that a couple of times, I think, in this series. Why do I always pick that one up? I really don't know. So we are stocking up on bars. Oh, let me. We'll make one more copper bar, then go plant these mixed seeds. Yeah, keep picking that up. We'll see what they sprout into. Um, 
Sure, we'll just plant them right here. Why the heck skis not? Oh, okay. I can't remember what path this technically is, but it's just a mod that retextures it. Oh, it's the gravel path. Okay, I was wondering what sound effect it was making. <laughs> gonna do just a little bit of resource collecting here get some more wood for future projects because I definitely want to build a stable soon I think that's gonna be my next thing oh also tomorrow I'm going to go to Marnie and get <gasps> I think it's Marnie's birthday today actually I was looking at the calendar and it's oh my god I've just been failing failing so bad. Okay, where's... There's Marnie. Um, she likes diamond, pink cakes. Okay, hold on. Let me bring up her whole... Whoops. There we go. Her whole thing. Yeah, fall 18. Oh, I do have a diamond. Oh, she likes amaranth, amethyst, aquamarine, bok choy, cauliflower... Let me see how many. I think I just have one diamond. If I only have one diamond, I'm not going to give it to her, but uh, I will give her something else that she likes for sure. Hopefully I can still get into her house right now at eight o'clock. I don't know. Maybe not. Where am I going right now? Oh yeah, mining stuff. Yeah, I just have the one diamond. Um, Let's get her an amethyst. I need to go to the mines again soon. That's a thing that definitely needs to happen. I'm probably not gonna be able to get into her house, but guys, we are going to try. I can't even get through this little maze of a farm. This will be the last, last thing we do today is go try to give Marnie her birthday present. What is happening? What is going on? Shane. Up late, huh? Here, have a cold one. <gasps> Guys, I'm cracking open a cold one with the boys, with Shane. Look at us, we're bonding. <gasps> oh my god. Buh, life. He's opening up to me. Look at that. He's, he, he's, oh. Aww. You ever feel like no matter what you do, you're gonna fail? Like you're stuck in some miserable abyss and you're so deep you can't even see the light of day? Oh, Shame. I just feel like how... I just feel like no matter how hard I try, I'm not strong enough to climb out of that hole. I'm gonna freaking cry right now. <laughs> Look at me, I'm tipsy. <laughs> Fast drinker, huh? Woman after my own heart. Oh my goodness. Are, are we being romanced? Are we being romanced right now? Yeah, I guess I have given Shane a few presents. Um, to increase our friendship level because I want him to like me. I don't know if I necessarily want to like romance him like for to marry him in the game or not but I'm I'm loving that we're at least increasing our friendship uh, and bonding. Just don't make it a habit. You got a future ahead of you still. Aww. He's normally so grumpy and not wanting to talk but look he's opening up so nice. Well my liver's begging me to stop. Better call it a night. See you around, Misha. Aww. What a sweet moment. Cracking open a cold one. I am flattered. Yeah, we're not gonna be able to go into Marnie's house, but yeah, it's locked open 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Okay, that's fine. Didn't get to give her a present, but I'm still so flattered that we got that scene with Shane, we've been increasing our friendship slowly but surely with a few uh, residents around Stardew Valley. <laughs> I am... There we go. Okay, we're better now. I was feeling it, though. That was so nice. Even though we didn't get to give Marnie her present. 
We still had a really fun time down there. That's Wow, I guess you have to go down there in the evening to get that scene with him. That's really interesting, huh? Yeah, that's like, I think my first, like, cut scene or like my first interaction with a character that really shows that our friendship is is developing so that's really really cool well, we got some more mixed seeds put all this stuff in here I'm gonna keep the stones on me I'm gonna put all this back away we're going to plant these mixed seeds real quick whoops next to the others I'll collect all that in the morning, but for now, let's just go to bed. Let's go to bed. I got all the sleepy babies in here, all the fluffy babies asleep. Oh no, I can't get to my bed. <laughs> okay, well, guess we. No, I don't like that there. Whatever. <laughs> there we go. Alright, we'll go to sleep for the night. We're gonna play through the next day as well. This one might not be as eventful, but we're at least going to get the well built. Sorry that I've been a little all over the place today. Sometimes I record and I like feel really on top of it, but sometimes I feel like I'm like tripping over my words and can't really get out what I'm trying to say or do the things that I'm trying to do, but I'm still having fun playing this game. We have a letter in the mail. Oh, there goes our sprinklers. Thank you, guys. Why are there a couple of spots it didn't water? That's interesting. Normally it waters all of them. Do sometimes the sprinklers just not work properly? And they miss a couple of spots? Or did it just know that there weren't crops there? I don't know. Misha, I'd like to buy a pumpkin from you. My daughter and I want to carve a jack-o'-lantern for the upcoming Spirits Eve Festival. Aww. Caroline, how sweet. I'm pretty sure I have a pumpkin or two. Let's see. I do. I have a gold quality pumpkin, actually. Hot diggity dang. So just bring Caroline a pumpkin. Okay, I think we will go... We'll do our little- oh, I forgot to close up the babies. I forgot to close the door for the, the farm animals last night. I always forget to do that. It feels so bad. Let's- yeah, I always do that. Start up some new mayo. Has that tree always been there? I feel like it was just growing. Trying to pet the, the dog as well, but it's not working. Alright, let's just visit our farm animals real quick. Pet all the chick chicks. Ooh, got some large eggs today. Nope. I'm gonna need to move this down here to make room for the hay. Right, so let's go see our dear. Excuse me. Excuse me, pardon me. <laughs> me, she looks fine. Thank you. Our hearts are slowly increasing with our animals as well. Oh, moo, 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 moo. <laughs> Always clicking the wrong button. There we go. Okay. We milking everybody. Milking everybody we're able to milk. Alright, thank you very much. Let's get these sweet babies some food as well. Then we'll go see the carpenter. We're just gonna go right on up. Get our well built. Come back. Um, go see go see Caroline. We'll take her that pumpkin. And if we have Oh, thank you. Is this a peach? Oh, an apricot. And if we have time on the way back from Caroline, we will... Oh, wait, I need to figure out where... Where the, uh, the well is going so that I don't <laughs> make... 
Abu Boo. Prince Abu Boo. We watched uh We watched Aladdin the other night, so that's fresh on the mind. <laughs> okay. Um Yeah, where should I'm thinking maybe right here. Maybe the well could go right here. Or I'm kind of wanting to shave a couple of columns, a couple of vertical rows, columns, whatever you want to call them, off of my farming space. So maybe I could place it just right here, right beside it. I mean, up here is also a good spot for the well. Oh. Choices. Choices. Yeah, I think up here. I think I'm gonna put it up here. This is just... Really? Really? This is just the proper place. Oh, I'm gonna have to move all of this around so that I can move these chests. I thought I had a mod that let me move chests anywhere. Oh yes, I can. Whoo! Thank goodness. I just had to unequip my tool and uh, left click on it instead of right click on it. Okay, cool. Let's go see the carpenter and get our well bu built. That's gonna be a good spot for it. We'll put something else down in here. Maybe, uh, maybe that'll be like the craft tables area because this right now is my little craft tables area with the preserves jar and you know machines and all that. Uh, But I kind of want a better, like, well, better laid out, more organized place for it. I'm not sure. I try to, like, look at other people's uh, Stardew Valley farms for, for inspiration. And, of course, I don't want to copy anything. But I'm, like, trying to figure out exactly how I want to, to organize it. If I want it to be a little bit more foresty and a little bit more kind of random but organized placement or if I want it to be a little bit more symmetrical and organized. I'm leaning a little bit more towards the messy but purposefully messy um, foresty overgrown sort of theme but still just still pretty organized. I don't know. I'm not making any sense right now. Okay. Construct farm buildings. <laughs> and here's the well. Let's oh, looks so pretty with this mod. So a thousand gold, seventy-five stone. Let's frickin' build it. Um, yeah, I guess just should it be right here? Should it be up here? I feel like it'll look really good tucked away. Yeah, right there. I like it right there. Cool. Alright, I'll start working on your new well first thing tomorrow morning. Awesome. I don't know exactly how long it takes. Probably, this one's a smaller one, so maybe just one or two days. Mara sure spends a lot of time working on those gadgets of hers. I bet we'll start seeing more people at the clinic this season. Aw, you think so? Everybody getting sick. Hope everyone stays healthy. I'm glad she's so dedicated. Aw. Alright, well, let's go find Caroline and- oh, I'm down here! Oh, I can't go into his room. No, not good enough friends with Sebastian. I don't think I've even glimpsed his room before, though. Oh, I wonder what this game is. Okay, I'd have to enter in there to look at it. I'd like to become better friends with, like, all of the residents eventually, but there are some I'm focusing more on first, like... Shane, I've definitely kind of been focusing on, focusing on just because he's so grumpy and I want him to like me. Um, and Abigail, I've been focusing on because I really like her. Marnie, I've tried to focus on, even though I missed her birthday yesterday because she has Mary Lewis's pants in her room that I need to get for a quest. <laughs> okay, where is... Am I missing Caroline? Am I just... Looking right over her. That's Elliot. That's Pam. That's Leah. Yeah, sorry. I'm... I'm trying. 
I guess maybe she's just in her house and it's just not showing her icon because uh, it's showing Pierre's icon. We'll see. We'll see. I'm sure it's fine. We also need to finish our community center bundles, which I'm really excited about. That is going to be, uh, we're going to finish the bundles that will unlock the greenhouse for winter, which uh, I will be using mods to do that. Oh my god, what a big day. We're getting a cutscene with Abigail too. Oh my god. I have been blessed on this day. Assuredly. Look at this. Oh my god. Misha? You scared me, sneaking into my room like that. <laughs> oh, she's playing a video game. So I've been playing Journey of the Prairie King for hours and I can't even beat the first level. This game is ridiculously hard. Well, either that or I'm just terrible at it. <laughs> I am so happy right now. <laughs> Hey, do you want to try this level to- Yes, we need to play video game with her, oh my god. I think I might do better with your help. Okay, yes! Let's just get married right now in this video game. Oh my god, I'm so happy. You guys don't even understand. Oh, I have no idea what's happening. Okay, we're shooting- oh god, okay. Oh my god. Oh no! We lost already! Here they come! Oh my god, I'm so happy that her portrait is the modded portrait again. Ah, oh god, I just did not move away from them in time. I'm so bad at this too. Abigail and I can be bad at video games together forever. Ooh, what's this? Oh no, Abigail died! Oh. <laughs> Her portrait is so cute. Whoops. There we go. No! <laughs> oh, we died so hard. Oh no, we didn't beat the level together. I hope that doesn't damage our friendship. That's gonna make me really sad if it does. Oh well, thanks for trying. Oh, I should have prepared. I should have been better. Oh. Oh. We're all going to hang out in the saloon this evening. It's kind of like a Friday tradi tradition, I guess. Cute. Alright, let's go back and see if we can find Caroline. Did I miss her? Um, oh, she's somewhere else now. Isn't she? Oh my god, I'm so confused. Oh, there she is down there! Okay, okay, okay. We're going. We're, we're booking it. We're gonna go take Caroline her pumpkins so they can- she and Abigail can carve pumpkins together. I, I, I need to make this happen. I failed Abigail in the video game. I was not prepared for that at all, but hopefully I can give her a happy, a happy autumn, a happy Halloween. Alright, where was she? She was somewhere down here. I think she was just walking around. Let me see. Oh, over here. Oh, it's so pretty, Al. There's Penny and the kids. They're so cute. Um, Starting about- okay, so she's in the- in the museum. Hello. Oh, there she is, reading a book. Finally, a little time to myself. Right. I have the pumpkin you requested. Oh, the pumpkin, it's a good one. Abigail will be so happy when she sees this. Thanks, Misha. Yay, I'm so glad. 
she's gonna keep saying the same thing, I guess. That's okay. Well, I am glad we finished our quest for the day and got another cutscene, two cutscenes with, with residents. I am just so, so happy, so flattered. <laughs> glad that we've been building those relationships. Okay, so we are going to stop at Marnie's on, on the way back up. We're going to get heaters for our little baby animals. For the winter time, want to just prepare in advance. Howdy! Yes, supplies shop. We're gonna get two heaters. There we go. Okay. And I did want to give Marty a present since I forgot forgot her birthday. So let's get out an amethyst to give to sweet Marnie. Look, there's Mary Lewis's shorts back there. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome, Marnie. Oh, I can go back here now. We're good enough friends. Oh my god. You found the lucky purple shorts. Better return to Lewis. Wow, I didn't even know. I didn't even know I could go back there. I don't, okay, I think next episode we are going to return Mayor Lewis's shorts that were so hilariously left in Marnie's bedroom. Talk about your town scandal. <laughs> but right now we're gonna go put these heaters in our our coop, in our barn. And have an early night, I think. Once we maybe we'll do some little a little bit of resource collecting or redecorating or something. Excuse me, guys. So where does it matter where I put it? I can just put it right there, put it in the middle. Oh, okay, they're just appearing out of thin air. That's okay too, I guess. Mm -hmm. Probably shouldn't put it on the hay. Can the whole barn catch fire if I put the heater on the hay? Probably not. So uh, they'll probably just end up gathering around it in the winter, maybe. That'll be real cute. Okay, let's go give a heater to our animals. Or our animals, our chickens. Our other animals. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and close them up in there. Since they're all in. And we will put our heater right here. And there you go, my chicky chicky chickens. Okay, let's get a few... few things going here. Oh, I need to rename this chest. Since I moved it, it took away the, took away the title. Call this one of those goods. And let's see, I need to get an egg out of there. I know, definitely I'm going to sell this. I'll sell a couple of those. Some of this I need to move because I don't really need to be in the good section, but that's okay. Um Salmon berries give, well, they give okay energy and health. I'll put them in mining for now. And chest number one, this is fishy stuff. So I'll name it fishy stuff. Okay. Make some mayo. No, don't eat the egg. Oh, let's put let's pickle something. What do you want to pickle? Pick anything and I can pickle it. Let's pickle um Let's do corn. I'm going to do I'm going to pickle some corn. There we go. It's going. All right, guys, it is getting late on the farm. Let's see if I can close my deer up officially now. Yes, they are all back inside, ready to sleep, and so am I. Oh, we need to collect our reward. Duh. 500 gold. Heck yeah. We're doing pretty good in the, uh, in the money department, I'll tell you what. Oh my god, an eggplant. Honey, an eggplant. Anything else to sell? Oh yes, this milk as well. Whoops, nope. 
Alright, and here's the future site of our well, our water well, which I'm very excited for. It's going to look really cute right there, especially with the mod that we have installed. Um, and I'm loving how our little farm is coming along. Thank you all for watching this episode. Like I said, sorry it's been just like a little scattered and all over the place. Um, this has been a good long episode. I've really enjoyed it. I'm, I might be adding a second day of Stardew Valley to my upload schedule next week or possibly the week after. It just kind of depends. Uh, kind of depends if Peter and I start up our uh, Animal Crossing, you know, series together and how often we end up posting those. So I will keep you updated. Let me go ahead and put... Okay, I don't have room for the stones now that I... Okay, I'll take the wood path, put that in goods. Let's go to crop stuff and put the eggplant in there. We got we got all our tools plus Mary Lewis's shorts. Got all, all the necessities on us right now. So next episode we will take Mary Lewis's shorts back and who knows what else. Maybe we will see... No, we won't see the completed well next episode. Um, but I'm sure we'll get another little quest or two or maybe we'll do some crop management next next week because I've, I've been kind of neglecting my actual farm like actually buying new crops and planting them um, but maybe maybe we'll do that next week <laughs> all right you all have a wonderful day be kind to one another and let's see if i level up in anything no i think after after selling stuff you don't level up in anything all right yeah you have a wonderful day be kind to one another and don't forget to be awesome bye guys